Today, as we gather together with Dusty and Abby, Lord, we just once again invoke your grace, your anointing, your power, your glory, and your presence into this ceremony. Uh, always put God first. Uh, may your home be filled with joy and laughter, family, good friends, great food, because you know I'm coming over to eat, uh, happy, healthy, well-adjusted, godly children, and may you love each other all the days of your life. Love, God's love in us does not insist on its own right or its own way, for it is not self-seeking, it is not touchy or fretful or resentful. It takes no account of evil done to it, it pays no attention to a suffered wrong. It does not rejoice at injustice or unrighteousness, but it rejoices when right and truth prevail. Love bears up under everything and everything that comes in and is ready to believe the best of every person. Its hopes are faithless under all circumstances and endures everything without weakening. Love, love, love never fails. Dustin, thank you for always being there and making me tough and being a pain in the butt. I love you. And you made me strong. You made me the person I am today. And Abby, thank you for being there for the last couple years. Um, it's not every day that you get to call your best friend your sister. So I think it's really awesome that I have that privilege for the rest of my life. As we look at the Bible, for both of you guys, we find out that God is the author of marriage. We find out marriage is, without question, the oldest institution on the planet. In fact, it's the only thing that we have in this earth that predates the fall of man. But you know what? Marriage was in the, in the original plan and the original intent. Therefore, we know that God's blessing is in marriage. know that God's blessing is in marriage. I want to remind you all that, that um, after today, it's no more an I thing or a me thing. It's a we thing and an us thing. There's a commanded blessing on y'all, uh, individually, now corporately together in your marriage. There is a commanded blessing on Dusty and Abby today as they come together. Uh, command the blessing upon you in your storehouse and in all you set your hand to do, and he shall bless thee in the land which the Lord thy God giveth thee. So man, I speak the blessings of Abraham, the blessings of Jesus, the blessings of the New Testament on your lives. With this ring, I thee with. I thee with. It is a token of my love for you. It is a token of my love for you. A reminder of my vow and covenant that I make now. A reminder of my vow and covenant that I make now. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Before God, before God, all of heaven, all of heaven, and this body of believers, and this body of believers, this represents my vow. This represents my vow and covenant to you. And covenant to you. This ring is a symbolic. This ring is a symbolic of our life together. Of our life together for eternity. For eternity. This ring, I thee wed. I thee wed. I give it as a token of my faith. I give it as a token of my faith. I believe with all my heart. I believe with all my heart that this is forever. That this is forever. It is my love and my faith. It is my love and my faith. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. This too is my promise. This too is my promise. To you before God. To you before God. All of heaven. All of heaven. In this body of believers. In this body of believers. I now pronounce you one together. You are now husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. <laughs> <laughs> it is my privilege to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Dusty Stout. Days, fun, nights, fall away. 
See the lights guiding me They show me the way Oh, oh, oh Take my hand I'll lead you home Escape our fate 